Hey guys, what's poppin? What's good? What's Gucci? And welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're here for the first time, you're most definitely welcome. And if you are a returning subscriber, welcome back. So guys, today is a very special day because I'm attending my very first event as a YouTuber. So come along with me as I take you guys to the Fluence Africa Festival. You're so beautiful and I guess you already know that. I gotta take off this do rack. You so hot when you step in the room, move back. I gotta do what I do best. Uh, I show you all, can I hold back? Uh, I tell my mama, I'm bringing you back. Then I lost your number, how'd I do that? In three days, and we hanging out. Put my head out the window, I'm hanging out. I call my bro just to help me out. Process everything, cause I hope I'm not tripping out. So guys, this is what I'm wearing to the festival. The suit is from Fashini. The boot tube is from Sheen. Earrings are from Temu. Bag is from the cot. My shoes are from Office London. My watch is um, it's a temple watch from American Swiss. My bracelet is from Fashini. So yeah. <laughs> Finally, I was on my way to the event, and let me tell you, I was buzzing with excitement. The anticipation filled me up like bubbles in my stomach. You see, I was off to the Fluence Africa Festival all by myself. Now, I don't mind doing solo outings, but solo events, now that's a whole different ball game. Anyways, I made it. Welcome to the Fluence Africa Festival 2024. Let's keep the content going. Remember, there are still prizes up for grabs as well. If you haven't reached the content hub just yet, please. Go and check that out. It's not going to be our longest session for the day, but rightfully so. Um, if I can just throw something in to sum it up, you know, to know um, how do I how do I land the job? How do I get the money? How do I get this? How do I get that? I think what we must be very cognizant of here and. Here's the thing, social media is a gift and a curse, right? Mm. It's a wonderful thing because it can change your life overnight, right? But the flip side is there are 50 million people trying to do the exact same thing. So what is it that you do that's actually going to make you stand out? We've got the amazing Mwase family industry empire here. They're here with the entire family. They really are. Um, which shows the love that courses through the work that they do. Offense, give us an opportunity, just tell us who you are and what's brought you here. Uh, hi everyone, I'm Ufense Mwase, I'm a cinematographer, I'm a filmmaker, so we, I specialize in mostly cinematography and I also do a little bit of directing here and there. Uh, we also create content together with my wife. Hi everyone, I am Smeen Shongo and I love I am a digital content creator and social media influencer, I create across pretty much all major platforms and I like all things beauty, lifestyle, but the biggest one is fashion. Okay, now I don't know about everybody, let's give them a round of applause. <laughs> I feel like me, six, seven years ago, is the same in the sense Do you think that you maybe just speak up for yourself more? Of course, of course. And obviously now my, my work is a little more refined and I, I take myself a little more serious. Because you are more refined yes. you know, as, a, as, a, as a woman. You know. um, but in terms of communicating to my community, it's they still receive me the same because I never changed. I was always in Zulu, Gipapi. That never went away. I still show up as that girl. Instagram, do you like, let's say if you want to speak about makeup, do 30 days of like, makeup tips or well, I've seen like people do 30 days of fashion yeah. on Instagram. I saw someone go in a month from 25,000 followers to 100K and she had been stuck on 25 for like three years. Yes. So it's kind of like follow what these platforms are telling Consistency, you. right? Yeah. Consistency. I know even with TikTok, you have to post like a certain amount of content in a week to grow. But if you're posting like once a week, you are not going to be recognized and they're not going to push you out because you're not consistent in sharing your content. Yeah. I think I Pose if you really with me. Yeah. You can build on that. Yeah. I, I also never take for granted my own behavior when I'm on any yes. platform, really. I never take for granted. Sometimes I sit there and I stop and I, I check what was my what was my moves, what did I click, why did I click it. So for instance, for me to click to your video, I would click on a video because she highlighted a problem at the get-go. So complicate mm -hmm. my life. You know what I mean? Like how Sneeze said, her mom says, makeup doesn't sit the same way on my skin at this age. And then you're like, I put on too many, I put on too much makeup and now my wrinkles are loud. Yeah. You know? 
Time for a quick ad break, folks. Now let's shift gears as we head over to the content hub. Hey! <laughs> so right now, guys, we're actually on a break before the next masterclass starts. But yeah, so far so good. Um, I feel so pine. I feel so pine. Anyways, guys, um, let's go along. Welcome to the Content Hub, where creators and influencers let their creativity flow. Take a peek at this kitchen, folks. Who would have thought that blue could make such a stunning kitchen color? Consider this your daily dose of kitchen inspiration, courtesy of yours truly. Now let's move over to the lounge. Now, honestly, I am loving the contrast. It gives off such a cozy vibe, don't you think? Imagine Netflix and chilling in this lounge. Shortly after that, guys, I made my way up to the rooftop for my favorite part. If you know me, you know I love food. So guys, I headed straight to the bar first to get something to drink because I was really thirsty. By the way, everything was for free. It was all inclusive in the ticket. So that was that was really great. Your girl is living a soft life. Thank you, Luazi. <laughs> This is the face of someone who has a full stomach. Let's go back to the masterclass. Instagram in 2012. And Instagram is focused more on the visuals. So who here uses Instagram primarily? Okay. Who uses Facebook primarily? I knew. I knew. I knew. Preparing your proposal for that business you're approaching, you need to show them what value you will deliver for them. And value comes in two ways. I'm either giving you something or saving you something. I'm either giving you more revenue or saving you costs. Only two things. I'm either giving you a new outfit or saving you embarrassment because you're looking kind of crusty. For me, something thank you. It's never about you. It's about the value that you are providing to somebody else. If you can answer that question and go, oh, those people need this, or I think people would do well with whatever. Sometimes dig a little deep, step back, just open your eyes and ears. It's all there in front of you. You just really mustn't be blinded by those who are already killing it, those who are doing well, and think that's the only way. It's like I was saying to you, speaking is your thing. Just find a way to package speaking and you're going to absolutely kill it. And, and Until next time, everyone. It's been a productive festival filled with learning and fun from free food to fabulous freebies and loads of valuable information. I've honestly need time to soak it all in. Now I'm geared up and ready to put everything I learned into action. Until we meet again, this is your girl, your Angolan Chiquita signing out. God bless you.